Columbia Gorge Community College uses a YouTube EDU site called CGCC Live to host videos. As an administrator, you can go into the videos and add a captioning file and one way to do this is to add a caption track that has both the text and the timing. The choices that we have for producing the text are one, transcribed by listening and typing, which is of course time consuming. Two, if you have a video script, of course you can cut and paste. Or three, find some kind of automatic voice transcripting like Google Voice. As I'm recording this, video, Google Mail is currently available by invitation only. However, people are using this technology and simply playing the video into their phone and getting the transcript via Google Voice. So that's one way to get the transcript that is potentially quite a lot faster than other methods. Once you have the text available, in this case, I'm just using a notepad file. A great way to make the timings is to use a free software product called Subtitle Workshop, which is available online. And it's a fairly easy to use process. The first thing that we'll do is to load the subtitle, in this case, my notepad file. And then the second part is to open the movie. Now we can add the timing. Now if we play this, we can see that the timing has been added. Now the next thing I'm going to do is to export this in a format that uh, can be used on YouTube. And a good format to use that is recommended is Subrip. Now if we go back to YouTube to add the caption, we can add a caption file that includes time codes, which we just made. So then if we go back to videos, we can see that the captioning is already uploaded. So in November of 2009, Ken Herenstein uh, a deaf engineer at Google announced automatic captions for YouTube and so one of the things I really like about YouTube is that it, it keeps improving its hosting capabilities so now in this new way we can we don't have to do the timing we can just have the transcript file so if I go in and pull up the caption file I think it does a really a pretty fine job of captioning the video. If I go back to my videos and then play it using the timings that Google has put together, it actually seems to work pretty well. The timings look a little bit different from what I had set up, 
but it seems to do a, a really fine job. So here is the MIT YouTube site, which is a beta site for automatic captioning. And you can see that you can automatically have the audio transcribed. And I think this does a pretty nice job. And I think if you look through uh, the videos, you'll notice some things that are not quite right. But as they say on the Google site, it's, it's, it's way better than nothing. And so I guess the question is, is this the new way?